overwhelmed by the vast variety of sessions here at the conference. But what strikes me most is the collaboration of the private sectors and of course the government and the experts in finding ways on how to address climate change issues. The most important thing that I learned from the conference is how to use the available resources in an efficient way for the better quality of the life. One example that I can give is that how to use the water uh, for multiple purposes from one sector to another sector. During the opening session, Queen Maxima made a strong statement regarding inclusive finance. I complete uh, her statement by saying that we, from the least developing countries, small island developing countries, we're not looking for charity, but we want to be part of the global market value chain. One of my objectives was meet new people, create new partnerships. I managed already two important steps forward with two important platforms. The Hansa cities, 150 cities working together and uh, trying to do things. They don't need to reinvent what we did. And the World Business Council for Sustainable Development. Many, many companies ready with solutions to help building resilience. Well, it's clear that adaptation to climate change must urgently be addressed. Journalists can track progress and report to the effectiveness of their government adaptation plans, including the private sectors. Well, communication here plays an important role in building awareness and disseminating the right information. Experts need to collaborate more with thousands of journalists from Asia, Africa, Europe, US, and elsewhere through the Earth Journalism Network to shape public debate on adaptation and solutions. One of the solutions I heard about is to bring the funds in one common basket that can go into the uh, master plan of each country. As you know, we know what we need. We do not have the finance, but trust us, we really can implement and give you the report that you need and also that it's make really a sustainable environment for all of us. One of the things I took away I like very much is the approach of Peter Bakker during the Business Council, where after a lot of talking, he came with a question, and what are you going to do differently tomorrow? What are your actions for the 24 hours? I think that is the mindset. We are here to go into action. That is a good way. I think one of the key messages from the conference is not to be the follower, be the leader.